the study investigates high-frequency seismic noise in the ocean using data from the Cascadia Initiative, CA, Ocean Bottom Seismometer, OBS, Network, hindcasts of wind speed, waves, and bottom currents predicted by a regional ocean circulation model and observed at sites on cabled observatories. The study focuses on seismic data in the 5 to 12 Hz band, which is best for detecting regional earthquakes and lies between the frequencies of local microseisms and seasonal whale calls. The study finds that median noise levels vary by 20 dB between sites at a given depth, but on average decrease with increasing depth. On the continental shelf, orbital motions of ocean waves are a major source of noise, while at the quietest sites in the deep ocean, noise increases when wind speeds exceed 10 meters per second. The study also finds that seismic noise is not predicted at specific sites on the continental slope and abyssal plain within about 100 kilometers of the slope by the bottom currents in the ocean circulation model. In these regions, ocean currents are inferred to be the primary source of noise because noise varies on tidal periods, is low on buried seismometers, and has spatial variations broadly consistent with those of median absolute currents. The study suggests that high-frequency noise is reduced by low-profile hydrodynamic designs, but not by shielding. Additionally, many OBSs record numerous short-duration events on and near the continental shelf that have been attributed elsewhere to animals bumping into the sensor or gas bubbles moving through sediments. This article was authored by Rose Hilmo and William S. D. Wilcock. We are article.tv, links in the description below.